Hello, Namaskar, Vanakkam. First, let me congratulate each one of you and also thank you for being part of the Study with Sudhir journey. Tomorrow, that's the 2nd of October, we will complete five years of the YouTube channel Study with Sudhir. So, thank you and congratulations. Now, you will that in the video, I have introduced a new term introduced kiya tha, ROI, yani ki return on investment. Let me today tell you one more new term, the business end. Now, if I have to take an example from, let's say, cricket, uh, the last few matches of the World Cup, which decide who go, gets into the quarterfinals or who gets into the semifinals, that's called the business end or the last few matches of the IPL. If I talk in context, it would mean the last few weeks before your board examination starts. So in your context, your business end will actually start from sometime 15th or let's say the 20th of December. But... In my opinion, the business end is really a rush period. Uh, any intelligent person will actually make use of the period before the business end actually starts. Then that's what makes the months of October and November very, very critical for each one of you. So listen to this video till the end because I'm going to talk about the October plan. Now, technically speaking, uh, half your academic year is over, right? April se September ka half the academic year, chhe mahine ka period khatam ho gaya hai. Now, if you are the kind of person who has taken it easy so far, now is the time for each one of you to get serious. Whether you are a class 10 student or a class 12 student, jin ke ki board exams hai. It is time to do a KYC. Jaise banks pe bolte na, KYC karna. KYC in your case would be knowing your curriculum. Ki syllabus mein kya hai? ऐसे भी होते हैं सिलेबस में क्या है बुक्स कौन से लेने हैं रेफरेंस बुक सबसे बेस्ट रेफरेंस बुक्स कौन से हैं बेस्ट क्वेश्चन बैंक कौन सा है एटसेट्रा एटसेट्रा सो व्हाई इज अक्टूबर सो इंपॉर्टेंट इट्स अ ग्रेट मंथ इन माय ओपिनियन बिकॉज़ इसमें काफी सारी छुट्टियां मिलती हैं मोस्ट स्कूल्स गिव 10 डेज हॉलिडेज फॉर दशहरा सम इवन अप टू 2 वीक्स दिवाली इज ऑन नवंबर 1 व्हिच मींस द डेज preceding Diwali, which October mein aayenge. So it makes the month of October this time completely a festival month. It's also a great month because if you want to make good use of the time away from school, jabki school nahi jana pade, there is no better time than October 2024 because many schools will conduct the first pre-board examination in the second half of November some in the first half of December. So it makes sense to make good use of October so that you are better prepared when the business end is about to start. So how are you going to make use of October is what I'm going to talk about in this video. In any case, Vijay Dashmi, uh, according to the Hindu calendar, is considered the best time to make a good start, a fresh beginning. Okay, so now guard lete hain. So I will tell you some basic things which are really strongly advised each one of you to do. Pehli baat to ye ki apna jo bhi study space hai na, jo tumhari maze hai, chair hai, table and chair, your study space, jitna bhi chota ho, it does not matter. Ensure that you keep it absolutely neat and clean. Jab koi bhi jaga saaf sutri hogi, it will attract positive energy. Agar books, you know, padi hui hai, it's all, you know, uh, very messy, good energy will not come. So ensure that you clean up your study space. Uh, your table is perfect. You know, there is enough space for you to keep your books and notebooks, etc. The You can arrange some things on your wall, some motivational quotes, etc. You can have plants like this one, like the jade or any of the plants, which will give you some kind of fresh energy to the room. Okay, it will make the entire space look that much more beautiful because a dirty place may sort of machar or makhiyayi aati hai. Okay. So if you want butterflies in your garden, you need to have the right kind of atmosphere. Okay. Now, 24 ghante hai. Kisi ke paas 24 ghante se zyada nahi hai. Kisi ke paas kam nahi hai. Hum sabhi ke paas utna hi samay hai. What we do with our time is more important. Out of 24 hours, if you are a class 10 student, I do not want you to spend more than 4 hours of quality study time on studies. I'm not including your project work. I'm not including your holiday homework, etc. 
I'm not talking about watching YouTube videos or videos on study with Sudhir. I'm talking only about study time char ganta. Agar aap 12th class mein hai, this has to be at least 6 to 6 and a half hours. Okay. So you can accordingly schedule that. Divide these 4 hours. And in the case of class 12, uh, divide these 6, 6 and a half hours into 1 hour in the case of class 10 and 1 and a half hours in the case of class 12 student. Class 11 and 12. Okay. 8 ghanta, class 9 and 10, class 11 and 12 ke liye, dead ghanta ke slots mein divide karo and divide it into 4 slots in the day. Assuming that chutia hai, jis din bhi chutti ho. Okay. Have one slot preferably in the morning. I like getting up in the morning. Today I got up at 3.30 uh, and I started working because I got up at 3.10. I decided whether to get up or not. Then I thought, chalo subay ka time use kar lete so, I started to So, do one hour in the morning, one hour between breakfast and lunch. But if you are the kind who cannot get up in the morning, then do two hours between breakfast and lunch with a half an hour break in between. Then do one hour in the late afternoon, post lunch. And you do one hour in the evening between, I mean, before dinner. Okay. And then you can have an early this thing. These four hours are purely for study. During this time, your mobile phone should not be in your room. Your laptop should not be in your room. You should have only your books and your notes to study from. You are studying. You are not looking at any videos. You are not listening to anyone else. You are not doing joint study. It is you and your books. Please remember this. Four slots or one hour each for class 10, I repeat. And one and a half hours each for class 11 and 12. Okay. Now, uh, if you are part of, uh, since I'm doing only two courses on uh, the app this time, the history, civics and the geography course for class 10, please listen to them at 1.25x speed. One and a half thora jada ho jayega. 1.25x speed pe suno taki jaldi jaldi sun sako. Okay. And each one of you who are part of the course, I have told you exactly how you need to study the order in which you need to study. Okay. Any doubts, ask me in, on the chat box there. Okay. Of the group. Uh, now, within the one hour, you may ask, Main karu kya us ek ghante mein? First of all, you target what you have to study. A particular lesson or part of a particular longish lesson. Aap decide kar lije. Us, us may ensure that the last 10 minutes are kept for revision of what you have studied in the previous 50 minutes. Ye zaruri hai. Ki wo usko revise kar lo, taki ek tarah se recap ho jai. That is very important. And, and focus on understanding the topic. Ki mere ko kuch bhi samaj mein nahi aai, us par mein kaam karu ki mere ko ye pura concept, whether it is a physics ka concept, whether it is chemistry or geography or any subject, mere ko pura samaj mein aana chahiye. That should be the focus and in the last 10 minutes revision and any doubts that you have had, note them down so that you can ask the relevant teacher about the doubt. That has to be done. So it has to be complete focus, no distraction. It is you and your work, nothing else. Train your mind ki main ek ghante tak is par focus karunga. Okay, that has to be done. Then what you need to uh, do if you have time beyond the four hours, raat ke time pe, dinner ke baad, neen nahi aari hai, ek ghanta kaar sakte ho. Try a test. Agar aapke paas kuch homework, project work ka kaam nahi ho, give a test, take a test. It could be grammar test, which are there, 25 papers for class 10, 20 papers for class 12, which are there on the app. You will uh, have uh, the different uh, books that I have recommended. You can use any test. Please keep giving test. Agar aapne ek chapter pada hai, Let's say you have studied a chapter of physics. Let's say electricity ka chapter pada hai. So electricity ka jo portion pada hai, usme apne aap ko test kar lo. Agar aapne aaj subhe uh, um, prepositions ke upar practice ki hai, take some tests of prepositions and do prepositions from there. So please test it. You could even, there are a whole lot of videos on YouTube. You could do it according to that also. So just, there's a whole lot of material, free material on YouTube and uh, the paid at a very reasonable fee on the app. Please make use of both. The ISC grammar test and the ICSC grammar test are of high quality. And I've been getting feedback from students who already purchased that. And that makes me feel good because I put the bar here. You know, I don't want to give easy, easy lollipop questions to solve it. I will go to the next exam. And if you have a little bit of Google in the exam, then you feel stumped. No. My idea is to prepare you for 
a tough paper that is my idea let me make it very clear now you may say isme kaun sa kab kya padhe morning time in my opinion you should study a subject like physics when your mind is fresh okay put cold water on your face and then sit you know so that your mind is alert physics morning mein uh, afternoon time mein study math so that neend na aaye because when you are solving you will not feel sleepy morning time between breakfast and uh, uh, lunch study subjects like history civics and geography because you won't feel sleepy at that time evening time you can do chemistry or biology you can rotate it like monday four subjects tuesday another four subjects wednesday the same four subjects you can alternate it or you can say monday tuesday wednesday ye char subjects mein padunga thursday friday saturday another four subjects i'll study entirely up to you see what works for you okay then get hold of quality question papers you know don't test yourself on very simple ones i mean i i have been kind of disappointed to see the kind of quality of some of the sample papers which are available in the market uh, and uh, the good news for you and uh, not and it's a very tiring news this thing i have started preparing uh, the i am going to do a question bank for icsc class 10 literature because i really thought you need my help there so i am going to prepare i have just started doing that's what i was doing at 3:30 this morning uh i started working on the mcqs i've did done the mcqs for two chapters so that i will put it on the app because i want you to be prepared because you need much more comprehensive material than what is available in different uh, books okay so that hopefully will be available sometime in november okay history civics and geography ka courses are there usme test papers hain but if you want only test papers uske liye aapko thoda intezar karna padega okay and i can tell you there are history civics geography courses are very good i'm telling you from the experience of the previous batches it's entirely up to you okay my only thing is that if you are doing it do it for both so that your entire social science uh, marks are together aisa nahi hai ki you do only history civics geography nahi karo ya the other way around then on one you get high marks the other mein niche ho jaye then the entire purpose gets defeated that's my uh, limited point then uh, the other point which i want to tell you is that when you are doing this test please ensure because test karna sirf kafi nahi hai usko analyze karna zaruri hai ki kahan par aapki galtiyan hui hain okay un galtiyon ko samjhe taaki the next test you don't repeat the same mistake so that is something the analysis of your test the sample paper test the mock test is very important so please do that the grammar test again again something like this becomes extremely important uh, so please uh, do that okay the sws grammar test is something which i strongly recommend uh, ss ke bare mein i have been i have talked enough about my only thing is that you know i don't want to repeat like last year where students wanted to buy it in january end and by the time we had run out of stock and the time was too short for us to print another uh, copy so if you are wanting to this thing don't wait till the end there will be no difference in price nothing of the sort see discounts hote the jinki bikri nahi hoti mereko wo sab mereko bechne ka karke wo dhanda nahi karne ka hai i want more and more students to get benefited from the book that's my only intention so just get that uh, if you want an idea about what is there in the book please see the four videos that i have done where i have read out essays from the book so that you get an idea just type argumentative essay on the channel search bar you will get a narrative descriptive feature composition you will get all that over there okay so that is something so don't delay if you are planning to buy is all i would say um, pcmb ke liye i do recommend oswal books i recommend the question banks very strongly in fact i what i will do what i plan to do is to do strategy videos for each of these subjects ki is saal कॉम्पिटेंसी फोकस क्वेश्चंस के हिसाब से आपको केमिस्ट्री के लिए कैसे तैयारी करनी है फिजिक्स के लिए क्या कैसे तैयारी करनी है बायोलॉजी के लिए कैसे तैयारी करनी है मैथमेटिक्स के लिए कैसे तैयारी करनी है कंप्यूटर एप्लीकेशंस के लिए कैसे तैयारी करनी है सो आई विल डू ऑल दैट एंड टेल यू एग्जैक्टली वॉट शुड बी योर रोड मैप इन द नेक्स्ट वॉट फाइव मंथ्स फाइव टू सिक्स मंथ्स आई मीन फेबर में तो आपके थर्ड वीक में एग्जाम शुरू हो जाएंगे सो दिस इज योर अक्टूबर प्लान This is your October plan. मेरे को November फर्स्ट या दिवाली के बाद बताना कितना हासिल हुआ कितना आप कर पाए बिकॉज एज ए सेट मेक गुड यूज ऑफ द हॉलीडेज यू नो दिवाली तो अगले साल भी आएगी यू कैन सेलिब्रेट नेक्स्ट ईयर ऑल्सो इन ए मोर ग्रैंड वे दिस ईयर इज एन इंपॉर्टेंट ईयर फॉर यू सो एनश्योर दैट यू मेक गुड यूज और वॉट एवर टाइम यू गेट फ्री टाइम यू गेट in the month of october taki starting with the pre boards you are able to kind of 
स्पीक एट द राइट मोमेंट इन द बोर्ड एग्जामिनेशन इन फेबर मार्च ओके टाटा बाय बाय अगले वीडियो में एक नया टर्म बताऊंगा ओके ये दोनों याद रखना आर ओ आई एंड बिजनेस सेट टाटा बाय बाय